Microsoft has added an X to their extension with their Office 2007 documents, and they are making them a little more web friendly, more XML friendly, and that's changed the way you're going to save your files and share your files. So what's happened is when you save a file without making any changes to Word or Excel and you're using Word Excel 2007, you send it to a friend, a buddy, or a co-worker that needs to use that document, they will not be able to read the document without a, an extension plug-in for their old version of Word or they have to use a free viewer that's available from Microsoft's website. And I do have a link to those viewers on my website at helpmerick.com. But here's how to avoid that whole mess is start in your program, Office 2000, any one of the Office 2007 programs. I'm going to start here in Microsoft Word. We're going to click on their little Office Orb. I love that name. And then you're going to click Word Options here at the bottom. When your options come up, you're going to click under Save. And then under Save Files in this format, you can see that the default is DOCX. And what you want to do is change that to the Word 97 2003 document and click OK so that all new documents from here forward are saved in a format that the rest of the world can read. DOCX format probably won't be a standard for at least four to five years, even if that if Microsoft is around that long. In Microsoft Excel, you have to do the same thing. Click on the little orb, click under Excel Options, and then again under Save. You're going to change it from the XLSX to just the old, good old XLS, the Excel 97 2003 workbook. Click OK, and then again, all future documents that you create from this point forward will be in the format that everyone can understand. So that's all there is to making Microsoft Office 2007 compatible with all previous versions. So you don't have to worry about sending incompatible documents or forcing your recipients to download viewers and plugins for their machine just to read your documents.